Hello, welcome back to my channel. I am Jay Holloway. Today we're going to be discussing last week's fragrances. I think I like this style of video. So we're going to keep with having it like a POV for the weekly fragrance review. So Monday, I wasn't feeling good. Didn't wear anything at all. Tuesday, got up, was like, let's wear something. And we went with Cherry Shock. And this is by Docus Arome. And this is the Perfume Mist, like an Elevated Body Mist or EDT. I really enjoyed wearing this. It was perfect. Then Wednesday, I was like, let me bust out something I literally have not worn in a while. And this is Tom Ford's Noir Extreme. This is a nice, spicy, sweet kind of men's fragrance. It has a note of coffee, which is almost like a ice cream dessert. I think it's from India, but this is nice. I really enjoy it. Perfect for a date night. And then that evening, I was like, you know what? Let me wear something that I used to wear, but don't anymore. And this is Bulgari's Rose Extreme or Bulgari's Rose Essential. This was actually a fragrance my grandmother had. And when she passed away, I got it and I wore it frequently. And then I was like, you know what? Let me just stop wearing this because I don't know if I want to be without it. But I decided to pull for it. And here we are. Thursday. Keeping it cute and ethereal. Dream Dusk by Estee Lauder. This is a cherry blossom and geranium dominant scent. Very cute. I really enjoy it. And keeping with that ethereal princessy vibe, we went with Roja Dove's Elixir. This was a fragrance that I discovered via Eva Monroe. She talked about it being uber feminine and just girly. I went to Neiman Marcus, sniffed it, loved it, had to have it. And I used to see it all the time on Scentbird, but it was only available as a subscription. And when I used to use Scentbird, I used to go with the a la carte option. I was not subscribing to where I was limited to only like two or three fragrances a month. I'm not doing that. Moving on to good old Friday. And we have Everything by T.S. Madison and Methra. Beautiful floral scent. I enjoy this a lot. It was great with my Roja Dove body cream, which is what I also used for the Elixir, which because it's the Elixir body cream. Highly recommend. Beautiful scent. And I think the longer that it sets up, the better it gets because I've had this for like over a month and it's really nice now. I mean, it was nice before. And then the good girl, Delina. And this is OG Delina. I bought this because I ended up buying the Delina body oil. And I actually really like Delina. But if I had to rank them, my favorites were La Rose, Exclusive, and then Delina. But she has a purpose, too. And she's beautiful. So Saturday, a random meet up with my friend and my godson. And I went with... The Harmonist Secret Water. Beautiful, strong, freshy, smells clean, immaculate, wonderful, has bergamot, tea, and it's just a host of delicious, fresh scents. Great for the summertime. Highly recommend. Then when I got home, Glow by JLo, and she is on her way up out of here already. So that was a good buy. And then Sunday, cooked dinner, thought I was going to clean, didn't clean, read a couple chapters in a book, and topped the night off with Chance of Fresh, one of my favorite freshies. So guys, that was my week in scents. Please like, comment, subscribe, share if you care. Stay tuned for more scented content. Bye.